Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a very long time since the last time I posted a video. So first off, I just want to let you guys know that in the background you will be hearing my fire alarm. It is dying. I need to get it. Actually, I just got a battery for it today and I need to put it in there. So you're going to hear it beep in this video. Sorry about that. My refrigerator is right here because I'm filming this in my freaking kitchen right now because I wanted natural sunlight and the only place to get that is in my living room slash kitchen area and that's why you see my background as my kitchen and you're going to hear the fridge going in and out. So I'm sorry ahead of time. Today I'm going to show you guys my used up products. I've never done a video like this so this is pretty cool. So let's get on to the video. All right so got my bag here. Cute little Valentine's Day bag for you guys and we're going to go ahead and start off with the first two things I see. These bad boys right here are like my number one favorite makeup remover wipes. This one is a perfect go-to if you're trying to get like a nice generic brand that's not going to cost you a lot of money. And I think there's also like a thing that they have too. Sometimes you can get two packs for like a dollar or more, which is such a great price. So this is what I get all the time if I don't want to spend a lot of money on the really, really good wipes for a really, really affordable price. And I usually get it from Walmart. These ones are the Neutrogena ones. As we all know, these are like honestly one of the best ones you can get as far as getting the makeup off. This is honestly like the number one packet of makeup remover wipes that I use when I want to spend a good amount of money on some good ones. Neutrogena is my go-to. They completely take off my makeup, like literally like instantly like I have waterproof mascara I have thick eyeliner if I have eyelash glue if I have like tons of like thick caked up makeup which is rare but when I do it honestly just takes it off super fast and I honestly only need one towelette in order for it to take off all my makeup which is really nice because they are a little more on the expensive side for only 25 packets it's about the same price as these purple ones here so you know what I mean so yeah moving on Okay, so next I'm going to show you guys my brush, which is so embarrassing, honestly. It is literally torn up from every single angle. As you guys can see, it's missing bristles, like, all throughout here and throughout here. I mean, like, it's, like, horrible. I've had this brush for over five years. I originally got it from a beauty salon that I used to work at. This is the brand Diva. Even the name is kind of taken off here but it used to say diva right here and it used to actually have the style of the actual brush on it and i've used it so much that it's torn off or worn off or whatever but this one here is honestly like the best brush i have ever used as you guys can see it has this curvature here which helps form to your head like this and for some reason when i use it it helps detangle my hair a lot faster as well as just like getting through my thick hair because i have pretty thick hair it gets through it really easily the next product is a product that I'm not sure if I would ever buy again, but it is one that I did use up. Unfortunately, this got used up like so fast because I do not wash my hair every day, so it builds up oil. Um, naturally, it just does that. So I had to buy a good dry shampoo. I heard a lot about this brand. This is the Batiste, and this is the one that's tinted in brunette, so it has like the brown color for my hair, which is so nice because I hate using the one that has water, water, powder because it totally shows and it looks like you have lice or some kind of powder on your hair like it like it totally shows that you're trying to cover up your oiliness and maybe use that baby powder or something like that and i got this from walgreens i want to say for like four bucks or something like that i really don't remember exactly but i probably wouldn't have purchased it unless it was about that price next is literally one of my favorite beauty products of all time like of all time and i started using this again like over five years ago when i used to work at the salon this is the swarshkoff repair rescue sealed ends treatment for damaged ends and it is just like a nice little cream that you put in your hair from mid length to ends and it, what it does it pretty much just mends your ends and kind of helps prevent them from sticking out like if you have all your split ends and just like your dead hair and everything it helps kind of like take them and smooth them down to help give you more refreshed non-split end look while kind of repairing them in a sense but obviously your split ends aren't going to be repaired like 100 percent but it kind of helps give them the appearance while somewhat treating your hair and helping it look and feel less damaged and less dry and just like you have a ton of split ends so i have two of them i used two of these already in the time that i've used up all these because i use it every single time i take a shower anytime my hair is wet and i use a pretty good amount too because i do have a lot of thick hair moving on we got this product and it is the wella professional Lux oil keratin restore mask and this is just like a really really good hair mask I absolutely love it. I've used it every single time I'm looking for a good mask. This one is literally completely empty. I mean, I put some water in there and got as much of it out as I could because this one is a little bit more on the pricier side. I want to say it's like $21 or $22, which is not horribly expensive compared to some really crazy masks out there. But 
for me because I'm a little cheapy like that. <laughs> um, this one is a little more expensive than I would have wanted to spend on this little tiny tub. I absolutely recommend this product if you guys are looking for a good hair mask by Wella Professional Lux Oil Keratin Restore Mask. Moving on, we got a little baby one here. This is the Smashbox Photo Finish primer and this is the actual uh color correcting one so this is really good for your skin if you have a lot of redness in it which mine definitely does it's silicone based so it has the nice soft dry feel to it so it's not going to take a long time to dry up on your face and you don't have to wait a long time to before you put on your foundation and it also just glides on really smoothly and gives a nice fresh canvas for your foundation moving on this one i feel like is part of the beauty related subject here so i decided to enter it into this little video this is the bath and body works aromatherapy sleep lavender chamomile pillow mist and if you guys haven't tried their aromatherapy line i definitely recommend going into the store and checking it out they have like the sleep section they have the stress relief section they have the energy section and i think they also have like another one i think it's called sensation or something like that that's supposed to be I don't even know. It's like pink and purple or something like that. This is my favorite though. This is the pillow mist. I actually have another one that I haven't used up, but it's the body mist. Same size. It's like a lighter color, but it's the body mist one. It just allows you to be able to put it on yourself versus on the actual pillow or your bedspread. As you breathe it in, it allows your body to relax and get more like calm, just like any lavender scented thing would. But honestly, I use this every single night. I spray this on my pillow. I spray this on my boyfriend's pillow. I spray it all over our bed. I've actually sprayed it near Kaya's area where she sleeps. That's my dog, by the way, if you guys don't know. And she sleeps better. I feel like it just helps all of us calm down and get a sense of stress relief. And therefore, it allows us to sleep well. So love that product. I literally have bought it multiple times and have asked for it for Christmas, for birthdays and everything. And I absolutely love it. Next, we have this product, which is again by the Wella Professional. This is their hair oil. And honestly, it is so amazing this is the Lux oil reconstructive elixir for keratin protection honestly the best hair oil i have ever used i absolutely love it it took me a long time to actually finish this one because i got it like i don't even know how long ago but it took me a long time just because a little bit goes a long way moving on we have another makeup product this is the bare minerals golden medium matte foundation and i use the matte one because a lot of the times my face was getting oily in my t-zone area it's a good price point it's about 24 dollars. i think they might have raised it to 27 or something recently but i remember purchasing it for like 24 bucks from like the store I was working at, I think Ulta has it, Sephora, pretty much everywhere has it, but yeah, let me go the medium. By the way, guys, do not be scared of like trying out yellow tones. This one is literally like yellow. And you're gonna be like, my face does not look yellow. But if you guys have redness in your face and you guys are like olive tone, this will definitely help kind of neutralize. So that's why I use the golden medium because I do have the redness in my face. If you guys are noticing that I'm like going like this a lot, it's squinting, it's cause like there's a glare over here now that the sun's moving down. So I'm sorry about that. All right, so this one is a top coat, which is pretty much gone. What's left in it is something I'm not going to use anymore because it no longer has the consistency that it had before. But this is the Sesh Vite or Sesh Vite um, top coat. Hopefully you didn't see it there. It's just the nice glossy top coat. If you guys are looking for a really, really, really fast dry top coat, like literally instant almost, I swear it feels like that. This is a really, really good one. Okay, moving on to my last two products here. This is going to be my Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced. And this is like my number one go-to mascara because it literally has the nice, thickest, long-lasting, blackest freaking layer onto your lashes and gives you this beautiful, full effect of long, beautiful, thick lashes. If you guys haven't tried it, I definitely recommend it. And this retails for about $22 or $23 or something like that. And on to the last product for today's video. This is the Professional by Benefit. And I'm sure all of you guys have heard the hype about it. This is a really nice pore minimizer. I guess you could say primer. I'm not sure if it's really supposed to act like a primer, but that's, that's what I've used it for before. And it works really well definitely helps minimize the pores i feel like it just kind of like it sounds weird but it feels like it clogs the pores or adds some kind of topical layer to your entire face therefore giving you like the smoothest canvas to work on because it's silicone based i believe however it is very pricey for this tiny little thing i want to say this is about the 0.75 ounce like the normal size i think this one here i think I think it runs like 20 some 21 dollars i want to say it also the last time i purchased it but i used to use it on my entire face because i felt like 
I didn't want to have just a smooth finish here. I wanted the smooth finish everywhere. So that concludes today's video on my beauty empties. If you guys did like it, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Let me know that you guys liked it. And if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. The button is down below, the red button there. And make sure you guys hit the bell as well because it lets you guys know when I post my next video. And you guys will be able to see it firsthand because you'll be notified ASAP. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.